welcome back to United Brothers. Uh, we got another fixed wing plane. Yes, we do. <laughs> by Aries. <laughs> oh, God. Again? <laughs> yeah, another one. Uh, this is actually, sadly, our last one, isn't it? Yep, yep. This is going to be our last uh, Aries product review. Mm -hmm. um, as of recently, a couple months ago, they were discontinued. Yep. Um, so they were a uh, Hobbytown specific line, right? Mm -hmm. So. Uh, ours doesn't carry these anymore. That's in Spokane, but I'm pretty sure there might be some hobby towns out there that still have a few of these. Um, we are actually are uh, getting them, kind of trickling in. Okay. Um, but they are in consignment, so there is no warranties or anything with them, okay. which is fine because you know most of the electronics are worth more than what you're paying for. Oh yeah, definitely. Because you um, said you got this for $29.99, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just alone, the battery is worth that. Mm -hmm. This is the bind and fly version. Okay. Um, but the ready to fly version is will cost a little more. Of okay, of course, yeah. yeah. Um, and if I'm not mistaken, you did throw a uh, AS3X receiver in this, right? Spectrum AS3X receiver. Yep, we're okay. going to try that out. See how that works. Yep. Uh, this is a four-channel plane with uh, elevator, rudder, ailerons, and throttle mm -hmm. with a steerable nose wheel. With, with the Which rudder. is really cool. I actually do really like, uh, as you guys can see, this linear actually does look pretty reinforced. It's super sturdy. I'm actually really surprised by that, you know, for especially for an Aries product. Yeah. Um, battery hatch is actually in a pretty nice spot from the appearance of it. Which uh, we'll see how that works here in a second. Yeah. <laughs> uh, also, high wing airplane, and one thing I noticed too, there's actually uh, Aries actually put two real servos on the ailerons. Yeah, Whoa, wow. that's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, most of their other airplanes we've flown only have the one. Yeah, that controls both, which I always thought was a huge fail point. It is, yeah, but so. that, those were uh, much smaller planes. Very, Very much smaller planes, so. yeah. Um, another really cool uh, point about this airplane, if you do find one, um, they're actually really, really easy to transport. All you gotta do is just remove this small little uh, clip here. Yep. And just basically pull that out and take the wings right off. Mm -hmm. That's all you gotta do. Super easy. Yeah. Um, the tail is completely glued together. Um, so if you do like end up breaking off your elevator, then you have to buy a whole new fuselage, unfortunately. And good luck finding them now. Uh, yeah, good luck. So, <laughs> so don't do that. Yeah. So uh, I think we should get this thing flying in the air. Also, uh, for a lot of you guys that were concerned for quite some time, I finally did upgrade my radio. I finally got a DX8, so my DX6i is gone. Wow. And uh, I gotta say, I waited too long. It's nice, man. It's I heavy. love it, man. It's really nice. It feels sturdy. Uh, this actually be kind of a nice little test for it. Yeah. All right, so I think we should get this thing up in the air, see how it does. Um, what, what kind of packs we're flying? We're flying on 1800 uh, 3-cell, right? 1800 3S. Uh, biggest one you can put in there is a 22. Okay. Um, but we're going to save those batteries for a, another video. Oh, yeah, you'll see. All right, man, let's have some fun. <laughs> let's do it. All right, man. You ready? Yep. Oh, my God. See if we can do it. Whoa. There we go. There was a lot of up on that. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Let's uh, fix that. That was perfect, actually. All right, we got it up. <laughs> Look at that. Wow, how many tries have we had to do for that? Uh, about three. <laughs> it's actually flying not too bad. No? Any bad tendencies on it that you can notice at the start right now? No, not at all. That AS3X was working hard. So we didn't have that, it'd probably be all over the place. Yeah, I mean, there's not too much wind down here, but up there I'm sure it's pretty significant. I'm only cruising about half throttle. Pretty nice, actually. It's super quiet, too. I think it has like a 15-inch prop on that thing. Dang, that's a huge prop. Yeah. <laughs> Doing a uh, nice uh, low flyby here. Let's see it. It's actually not too fast. Oh. Huh. That's cool. So that's full power? No, this is full power. <laughs> Woohoo! Is it, is it slow in rolls or is it actually pretty maneuverable? No, it's actually very maneuverable. So it definitely doesn't feel like the gamma? No, this is completely different. Let's see a barrel roll. Yeah, let's see it. Pretty fast. That's bad. really nice, actually. And the rudder's nice and responsive. He's got a lot of throw. Yeah. Backflip. Woohoo! Uh, so what do you notice about it so far? Um, the control surfaces are super responsive. Um, it has plenty of throttle. Um, let's see if it has an infinite up on it. I doubt it, but we'll probably not. Anyway. So come in nice and low, and then go straight up. <laughs> that is actually really good. I'm, I'm actually pretty impressed on this. Especially for being an Aries uh, airplane. Yeah. Since we got the uh, elevator sorted out, it's actually really good. I noticed with most of their planes that you do have to trim out a lot. There of is stuff. a lot of tinkering. Yeah. Uh, not ready out of the box like an e-flight plane at all. No, not at all. Uh, actually, every single gamma that we put together, we put together probably get six or seven of those now. Yeah. Those I always had to uh, readjust the servos, the linkages, had to go through trim them like crazy. This we actually had to go in there and trim one of the servos too, which I was surprised. Mm -hmm. Well, not trim, adjust one of the servos. <laughs> that was cheeky. 
Looks like you're having a good time. Yeah. I think actually does really good. You should go up and do some of the Robert tricks. I'll try. That's actually pretty cool. Should I try the inverted? Yeah, you should. You gonna go low? Uh, not not the first time. Okay. <laughs> we'll see how it <laughs> we'll does it. Twenty mistakes high. At least it has a faster roll than the other planes we tried with others. It does, yeah. Never listen to flight test. Three mistakes high isn't high enough. Nope, need at least uh, 30. <laughs> 20 or 30 is good. <laughs> All right, here we go. Going over. Wow. Holds it really well. Yeah, I'm giving about half down. Okay. And it's still losing altitude too, isn't it? Yeah, a little bit. So we probably wouldn't trust inverted super low with this one. We're going to try it anyway. Okay. <laughs> You're going to have me do it too, aren't you? I think I'll give it one go. Okay. And we'll bring it in and get some uh, quad footed. Let's do it. Come back around. It, it, looks, it looks really nice though. It does need quite a bit of throttle inverted. Really? Okay. Yeah. At least uh, three fourths. Okay. There you go. That is awesome. Got enough power to pull out of it too. That's really cool actually. I'm going to come in and land and give it to Robert. Alrighty. Let's do it. Let's see how that landing gear holds up. <laughs> oh man. I wonder if it's going to be, you're going to need some speed for this one. I'm not sure. It seems pretty floaty. I haven't, oh, let's try the stall first though. Yeah, for sure. I'll get back up. Okay. That's plenty of power. Yeah, you do. The throttle. This is very different for an Aries plane for me. That's gliding. Wow. So that's full back and just gliding. That's dead stick. Wow, that's actually really impressive. And we'll stall. Wow, very predictable. Wow, holy crap. Aries. Land on that for sure. Aries. <laughs> what are you doing, Aries? Yeah, she made something really nice. Just playing out, please. That's good. All right, bring it back towards us and I'll land. Nice timer. <laughs> Oh, perfect timing. No pun intended, I promise. <laughs> I'm just gonna dead stick it. Go for it. Pretty comfortable with that. Oh. Well, that's the best landing I could hope for. <laughs> this thing is super awesome. I actually like it. Um, on this type of grass, you do have to have like full throttle and then let it go and then it'll just take off, which is awesome. Um, but yeah, let's give it to Robert and get some quad footage. All right, let's try it. Let's do it. All right, you see me? I'm off to your right. You got you. You got me? Okay. All righty. So, should I go up and do some tricks first, or should I do the inverted? I lost you already. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm coming back towards me and you I right see. now. Okay. Got you. you got me? Yep. All right. All right, what do you want to see first, man? Anything, man. Do any tricks. All right. So, I'm going to climb. Let's, take a, let's turn to left here. Okay. And then I'm going to climb and see if I can do some of my tricks. And I can definitely feel some extra weight from that camera, but, man, this thing is not having a problem. Yeah. All right, you ready? Go for it. That look cool? Yeah. It's so fun to do that kind of stuff again. <laughs> Alright, should I try inverted? Sure, go for it. Okay, so you said definitely need some uh, down, right? Yep, about uh, half down. Alright, see if I can do this. Do the gamma, I can do it with this, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, All right. dang it. Oh, you got it? Yep. Okay, oh. God, I hate that. God, it's so scary. <laughs> That's got to scare you so much. Every single happens. time. All right, let's try that again. I need to change out this receiver so bad. <laughs> Don't go so far. <laughs> you got it. All right, I'll, I'll come this way and then we'll turn around and we'll get the inverted going. Okay. I'm a little nervous with this camera. There's some extra weight on there, but I'll, I'll try to do it. It's on the center of gravity, so it should be fine. Yeah, it's not bad. All right, is this good? Cool. I'm gonna turn around. Cool. I'm gonna turn around. All right, and roll. May oh, maybe. maybe. <laughs> nope, she's having some issues with that. Really? <laughs> yeah, let me try it again. I was going a little too slow for much weights on it, it's a problem. You need quite a bit of throttle to do it. So. Yeah, I do actually. I'll get over there, I'll give it about three fourths. Okay. Of course, not too worried if this airplane crashes because uh, it wasn't very expensive. And I got a second one, so. <laughs> <laughs> All, right, all right, let me see if I can set this up again. That was a pathetic attempt. Yep. All right, turn left. All right, rolling. 
A lot of power, a lot of power, a lot of power. Oh my god. <laughs> good. Look at that. Oh my god. Oh, there you are. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> How did I do that? That was scary. Is that camera not good for it? Whoo! <laughs> I did it. I did it. That was scary, man. Nice. <laughs> do it again, right? Yep. Try to do it again. All right, taking a left. This thing is sketchy with that camera on there. See if I can get a little lower. Like it was fine without it. All right. Oh, you're good, man. You're good. Oh, my God. You're oh my God. <laughs> you're so low. Jeez. Doing good, man. Look at that. Thank you. All right, let's go do some tricks. You ready? Go for it. I lost you. But... Um... Woohoo! Oh, there you are. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I'm actually pretty impressed. You know, it's only Aries airplanes I've ever done that with, so right, it, one, is, it is something, right? Do one more trick, and then I have to land this All right, thing. you got it. All right, I'm going to turn around left here, okay. and I'm going to climb really high. You ready? Do it. See if we can do a couple of those uh, twirls of mine. All right, you ready? Go. Here we go. Woo! Nice. That was sketchy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I think it's time to bring her in? Yep. You know what I'm going to do? I'll watch you land. For my finale, I'm going to do one last invert. Okay. If I can, if I have battery left, let's see. And rolling. And inverted time. Whoa, Ooh, whoa, whoa. My goodness. That was sketchy. <laughs> it's trying to stall on me there. Jeez. Got it. All right, let's land time. It worked. That's where you landed. I'm going to come back around us and land. Okay. The same direction I did the inverted that. Okay. See me? Yep. All right, let's do this. Give it some throttle. Nice. You can, you can dead stick it in too. It flips. Oh yeah, no, like I said, nope. just with the camera though. Oh, Dang you it. just lose it. <laughs> there it went. Oh, Here she comes. Thing. Oh, dang it. <laughs> All right, so that was actually really good. That was awesome. Yeah, that actually good time. flew amazingly well. I <laughs> uh, did have a bit of a mishap, unfortunately. The quad yeah. did wreck, right? Yeah, well. It happens. Yeah, it happens. yeah. The receiver and the thing's terrible, so I'm changing it. Uh, nothing too terrible, like something you can fix pretty soon, right? Yeah, yeah okay. it'd be easy. So, uh, I did inverter with this. Mm -hmm. That was some of the scariest stuff I've ever done. <laughs> it, was, it, it acts completely different with the camera on there. Yeah, it was cool. It was fun. Yeah. I uh, I don't know if the camera got it. We'll see in the, the final product, mm -hmm. but uh, I did get a little bit of a tip stall upside down. Yeah. Luckily, I've, I've had it happen so many times, I know how to counteract it, but mm -hmm. this thing did really well, especially having all that weight on there. Yeah. Um, first off, I was really impressed stall-wise. Stall mm -hmm. characteristics are really, really solid. Really predictable. Yep. Really predictable, solid. Um, it, I mean, it flies like a high wing plane. Mm -hmm. It's very forgiving. Mm -hmm. um, and also the speed is like that perfect a little bit. It's got power, it's got torque, but it's not too quick. Yeah, exactly. Especially for <laughs> someone that's maybe getting into our first four-channel airplane, this might be a good option. Mm -hmm. um, it doesn't have infinite up, but it does really have a... It has good power to it, so you can oh, pull out of yeah. stuff. Yeah. yeah, you have plenty of power to get out of things. Yep. Uh, some of the some of the weak points for me definitely have to be some of the construction quality, just like any Aries airplane, which yeah. we'll put a list up <laughs> of what we don't like and do like yeah. from now on. Uh, I think this airplane, from a 1 to 10 mm -hmm. on, let's say, the difficulty to fly, I'd say it's a 4, definitely a intermediate, wouldn't you say? Yeah. Uh, beginner intermediate. Mm -hmm. So. Um, like we said, this thing is discontinued, so unfortunately we can't really direct you towards a product page. Exactly. Um, yeah. Like we would. Yeah. Um, but if you have a hobby town, maybe they might have one. They might have Just a couple left. Uh, or go on eBay. eBay's a good, good yeah, place sometimes, yeah. too. Really good eBay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, uh, very, very impressed with this thing. Mm -hmm. um, we are really sad to see Aries go. Like I said, they definitely had a few products that um, were pretty ambitious. Yeah. <laughs> you know, we've had some fun with some of their products over the years, but, you know, it's meant to be. It's going to happen. So, yep. I'd say for a final farewell to Aries, this airplane has definitely impressed us. Definitely a good one. Um, not bad at all. Mm -mm. I'm, I'm actually really impressed. Uh, what do you think this airplane score should be? I'm going to give it an eight out, of, 8 out of 10. Definitely. Mainly because uh, the two points off because of the tail, you have to glue it together. Yep, as well. And then uh, one, one other extra little tip, just when you're taking the wings off, we kind of want to advise everyone. Mm -hmm. uh, this little clip right here will fall out. Yeah. So make sure you <laughs> actually take the clip and put it like in your pocket or something. Cause yeah. you lose it. If you lose that, then you have to... Uh, Buy this whole plastic piece. Uh, another reason for the minus and two points definitely has to be with all the tinkering you have to do. Mm -hmm. oh, uh, yeah. You have yeah. to tinker with these like crazy. Every Aries airplane we've had, we've had to tinker with. Once you get it dialed in, it flies amazing. Yeah, it, yeah. Did, it did really well. Um, like I said, we're sorry to see them go, mm -hmm. but we're, we're really grateful for the last couple of years we got to test some of their airplanes. Definitely. All right, guys. Well, hey, my name's Robert. I'm Damon. Uh, this is United Brothers, and we'll see you guys again next time. See ya. <laughs> it is insane how cocky you are. You're you being so cocky. <laughs> Nice.
Come on, camera, hold, keep up with it. <laughs> I got this little black speck is all I see. Crying out loud. No kidding, you did this whole park in like two seconds. There we go, that was a good one. This is insane, I can't believe I'm following this thing. Kind of, oh ho. Dude, this is absolutely insane. Dang it! 